and police are searching for a gunman who opened fire on the 405 freeway, wounding a driver and creating a massive traffic backup. CHP officers shut down all northbound lanes of the freeway during rush hour, searching for clues. Our Pedro Rivera live in Tarzana, where the victim was treated. Pedro. Micah Share, we're told that victim was being treated for non life threatening injuries. Treated here at Providence Cedar Sinai Tarzana Medical Center. If you were out there today at all driving on the 405 this afternoon northbound, you probably noticed the massive delays, the massive backup, and that's because CHP had to shut down a portion of the freeway so that they could hopefully find some evidence. Take a look at what it looked like here from overhead uh, from Sky 5 earlier today. According to CHP, a call came into distance dispatch about a possible car to car shooting on the 405 freeway in Van Nuys. When officers arrived, both vehicles were already gone, but dispatch received a call that the victim was at the hospital being treated for that night non life threatening injury that person sustained during the shooting. We're told the victim was shot in the upper body area, but is OK. As CHP investigators walked up and down the 405 at the Victory Boulevard exit looking for clues, and they even called in canines, as you see in the video, hoping they can sniff out anything that would help them in their investigation. To safely do that, cars were detoured off at Victory Boulevard, leading to that massive line of cars for miles, moving at a snail's pace. Later in the evening, the number four lane was open between Sherman Way and Victory Boulevard, but it wasn't until 7 o'clock tonight that finally the roadway has finally reopened. So if you were to drive on the, four, or the uh, 405 tonight, you should be okay. Now, we're still learning more details as to what led to that shooting, but we were told that it was possibly a robbery that happened off of the freeway that eventually spilled on to the 405. Still getting more details confirmed for you tonight. But as for the suspects, no description has been released, and so far, no arrests have been made. But police are asking you, if you live anywhere in the Encino area or anywhere uh, near Van Nuys where this happened, and you saw something suspicious off of the roadway leading uh, to that shooting. Please get in contact with CHP. They can certainly use your help tonight. Reporting live in Tarzana, Pedro Vera, KTLA 5 News. Pedro, thank you.